What's up everybody? This is Bailey Maloney and today I am back with another figure review. Today we will be looking at the Jack Specific 4 inch Blaze the Cat figure. Now Blaze was released for Wave 14 along with Knuckles 2.0 and the Angry Sonic as well as Shadow the Hedgehog but this Blaze the Cat figure I I was so ready to have her in my collection along with 2.0 Knuckles. What do you say we get a good look at her accessory? Now this is a Soul Emerald that Blaze the Cat comes with. I gotta say that this does fit her character quite nicely. Apparently this is a red Soul Emerald. I believe that's one of, I think that's the first Soul Emerald that Blaze had to collect for Sonic Rush. Um, the moment I, now the moment when I saw Blaze in her box, some of the pictures, I thought the, the pictures that had Blaze with the Soul Emerald, I thought that uh, it's going to be a little smaller, that the uh, Soul Emerald was going to be smaller, but apparently this one's pretty, pretty big. Um, I kind of wonder what it's like. In fact, I kind of wonder if Jack Specific will get around to making more Soul Emeralds. We, we already, they already completed the seven Chaos Emeralds set. So if they can complete that, then I have hopes. I hope that Jack Specific can complete the seven soul emerald set so yeah and now the main attraction blaze the cat the painting and the painting and the sculpting of this figure looks immaculate they got the hair pieces right her headband at her little bindi on her forehead um the coat, the coattail looks nicely done, properly sculpted. They got the tail right, pretty on point. Looks, the, oh, the cuffs on her, the cuffs on her gloves and her shoes are made out of plastic, and. Yeah, they, they're only going to make some impressions, but not that much. They're not going to point you. They're not going to poke you. The painting and sculpting on the shoes are nice, except a little bit of a paint smudge on there, but that's okay. No harm done. When I got her out of the box, I noticed that she had a purple smudge on her left eye right there, so... I had to break up my paints and paint her up and cover up the smudge right there. So yeah, other than that, I really, really like this figure. She looks nicely, nicely done. I love her so much. <laughs> so with the painting and sculpting out of the way, time we go over to articulation. And as always, starting from the head down. All right, her head can move left and right and could do a 360 with some up and down movements, which is nice, really nice. Her arms go in and out, forward and back. Swivel on the wrist. The wrist can go up, down, all the way around. Her legs go out about that far, back about that far. Well, to be honest, not that far because the dress part right here limits the articulation. Bend and swivel on the knee. And the ankles can swivel and the ankles can go up, down, all the way around. In addition, her tail can go side to side. <laughs> Isn't that neat? 
Louise the Cat is definitely one of my favorite characters from the Sonic the Hedgehog franchise and you know what? I wish that she is... M I personally wish that she was in more Sonic games because she is... Aside of her being wicked cool, she has pyrokinesis, which is basically the ability to control fire. She is from the soul dimension, hence, hence why her accessory is a soul emerald. So yeah, the more we can see Blaze the Cat in future games, the happier we'll be. Alright, now it's time to do some size comparison. Here she is next to Sonic the Hedgehog by Jack Specific. Here she is next to Cream the Rabbit. Now Sonic is a little taller than Blaze is and Blaze is a little taller than Cream. For more size comparisons, here she is next to Amy. Now, with all the modifications I had done with Amy, she's shorter than Blaze. For more size comparisons, here she is next to her BFF, Silver the Hedgehog by Jack Specific, and my custom figure of Marie and the Raccoon. And so, Team Dimension is united once again. Well, that wraps up my figure review on Jack Specific Blaze the Cat. If you like this video, don't forget to leave a like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. Also, in the comment section, since Blaze the Cat has, has now been added to the Jack Specific figures, which female character do you think that Jack Specific will make next? For me, that will have to be either to call the echidna or wave the swallow. This is Bailey Maloney signing off. Peace!